Hey guys, on today's video we're going to be updating Pro Video Formats and Safari, so let's get down to it. Right here is your Apple logo on the top left hand side of your screen. So let's just click on your Apple logo. We're going to go straight into System Preferences, that's your second option. In older OS's on your Mac, all the updates would be under the App Store. Right now, most of them are in System Preferences and only some, for some apps, are still in the App Store. So right now we're just going into System Preferences right down here below in the third line we will see software update let's just click right there this will load up and it's gonna load up safari plus other updates if you guys have any other updates they will come up here so we're just gonna wait for this to load and we shall see these so right now it's gonna tell us to update if we haven't done so already if you guys did that you will not see this message and some max will just not be able to update to this new OS. Anyways, right down here, you guys will see more info. Let's just click right there, more info for more updates. And finally, here we have Pro Video Formats and Safari. So we want to check mark both of them. Yes, exactly. And we're gonna go and install them both. So if you don't have your Safari closed, you guys can just click on close application and install. So there we go. So Safari's just closed by itself, you will see your desktop or whatever other programs you guys had open. I had Chrome in the background, so that just went in the background. And right now it's installing the two updates. How big are these updates? Not big at all. So it does depend on your internet speed, how long these will take in order to download and then install. Well, the installation is more uh, to your Mac. If your Mac is really nicely running really nicely, it's not slow. It's going to install these programs without a problem really fast. The downloading time, however, that depends on your internet speed. So if you guys have really fast internet speed, well, you're looking at this less than two minutes. With uh, regular speed, you're looking at, let's say, five minutes. For those of you with extremely slow internet, yes, this could take 20 even 30 minutes but i doubt it only with those of you who have extremely slow internet this will take those 20 or 30 minutes but like i said with medium speed usually just five minutes and you're done downloading plus installation because it's not a huge update even for safari i do want to mention that you guys have this down here below where it says automatically keep my mac up to date do not have a check mark there. So if you guys have a check mark there, just click on it and take it off because you do not want that. <laughs> There's some updates that you guys may not want to install on your Mac by themselves. You guys want to make sure what's being installed and when it's being installed. So you know if something happens, you know why it happened. Anyways, right now it just updated. It's all done. We're all done with that. That's why we're not seeing any other updates besides this one right here that I will be doing a video later on. And that would be it for this video tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, you guys can write down here in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.